What's up guys, Almighty Game here, welcome back to another Red Dead Redemption 2 video. In today's video we're talking about some news and some spoilers for Red Dead Redemption 2. We'll start off with some news and then we'll move on to the spoilers. But I'll let you guys know before I start talking about the spoilers, just in case you don't want to hear about them. So before we get started, I just want to say that according to Fun MW2, Red Dead Redemption has gone gold. Going gold means it's finished, in its cases, in boxes, ready to be shipped off. It's still 21 days until Red Dead Redemption 2 is released, so I don't think they'll ship it straight away. They'll probably just keep it in the boxes in the factories and wait maybe until a week before, so people can't get the game early. So let's get on with the news. The Telegraph have confirmed in their preview that Red Dead Redemption 2 is Rockstar's biggest ever map. Rockstar Games used over a thousand actors for NPCs. Every single NPC has their own personality and mood state. On the Rockstar Social Club website, Snapmatics have been changed back to photos. IGN left a house with some oat cakes, canned food and a pack of premium cigarettes, one of which they lit up outside. Net effect, stamina up, health core, meter down. The longer you spend on your horse, the tighter your bond grows through four levels. Each level provides a new riding ability, like being able to rear up on command, perform dressage, and eventually pull off a unique version of drifting with a slide turn. You can choose to browse for shelves, similar to how ammunition works in GTA 5. Or flip through a catalog. The catalog is a little easier to navigate and it's filled with period language and illustrations. The musical score shifts to reflect your moral alignment and your character's posture and facial animations change. Players have their own honourable and dishonourable deeds tailed as they play. Rockstar says it's not as linear a system as it was in the first game. If you lose your hat, it can be found on the mini map to go pick back up. Now time for the spoilers, so this isn't a big spoiler, it's just about the map, so if you're interested in the map, stay tuned, but if you want it to be a surprise, um, probably leave the video, but don't forget to leave a like. So this information is from InsideGamer.nl, so someone asked them a question saying, are Armadillo and New Austin in the game? Answer, yep, after asking Rockstar, they told me that an entire map of Red Dead Redemption is also in the game, but of course, there are many more areas added. In the 6 hours I played, I only got to see a small part of Blackwater, and even that was already gigantic. 6 hours was not enough to see any of the other familiar places. So from that spoiler there, from InsideGamer.nl, they're saying that the entire map of Red Dead Redemption 1 is in Red Dead Redemption 2, but with some new places added. So that's all the information we have for today. On Monday, I'm planning to start my Red Dead Redemption 1 streams every day, starting on Monday. I'm going to be playing Red Dead Redemption 1, doing the missions. I've never played the full campaign of Red Dead Redemption 1, so I'm kind of excited. And the main reason why I want to stream the Red Dead Redemption 1 story is because a lot of people who will be getting Red Dead Redemption 2 has probably forgot what the campaign and the story and the missions are all about. So I want to give you guys kind of like a refresher. So thanks for watching, don't forget to leave a like, comment and please subscribe.